Christmas. Uh, and a Merry Christmas. It's Christmas Day today and uh, what I'm going to do, uh, because I, I live on my own, I uh, get to for one. I'm going to today make a uh, duck breast. So I'm going to show you. If, if you look, I've got a nice duck breast here. Beautiful this. And uh, I'm just going to very gently score the flat. I'm trying not to dig through the fat into the flesh. So, I'm just, this is the first job. I'm just, it's a very sharp knife this, so I know I'm scoring the fat. So, there you go. Right. Right, the next job is, all I'm going to do now is just uh, to put a little bit of salt there. And I'm going to just place the breast fat side down. And I'm pressing it into the salt. I want that salt to get into the fat. Okay. I'm going to wrap that in cling film and just put it in the fridge for a couple of hours. The next step then is we're just going to slowly fry it so all the fat starts to come out for about 15 minutes. Turn it over on its flesh side, 5 minutes. Leave it to rest for a couple of minutes while I get the potatoes and the tomato compote out. And uh, slice and serve. Next step. Cover it in cling film and I'm just going to stick it in the fridge now for a couple of hours. Right viewers, it's duck time. So, I'm going to show you how I do my duck. Uh, you might choose to do it differently, but I'm just going to take the duck, which has been taking all that salt on, and I'm just going to place it on a cold pan. And I'm just going to let that cook. And I can hear the fat bubbling. Once the fat's bubbling, I'm going to let it sit there for about 15 minutes and then turn it over and cook the flesh side for about 5 and um, let it rest for 5 to 10 minutes and then slice it. <laughs> right, I'm sure you can hear the uh, duck fat starting to sizzle now, so I'm going to just let that cook very slowly. Um, on a medium ring, low light, and keep it sizzling for about 15 minutes. Okay, 15 minutes are up. Oh my goodness, look at that. So I'm just going to cook this uh, flesh side down there for 5 minutes and then I'm going to leave it to rest for about 5 minutes and then we'll slice it. And here's the test. in the middle there. I'm very happy with that. There you have it. 
bit of a masterpiece this, uh, pan fried duck with uh, butter bean mash and uh, tomato and butter bean compote. Oh yes, Merry Christmas everybody.